Yep. There's uh, Krista with the Wooly Bandits. Yep, Krista with the Wooly Bandits. Here's another one of her shots. Awesome. Were you ever at any of the Rodney Wiemannheimer uh, gigs uh, that he was promoting the Wooly Bandits? Um, I was at one art... When he did his DJ, his DJ club at this art place, uh -huh. his old DJ club, and I was there with Krista and some other people. Was that placed over by Amoeba Records, just off of Sunset? Or? Something like that. Yeah. I don't remember the exact address. Uh -huh. was... Yeah, there's also the uh, Cantner's. Cantner's Deli? Yeah, Cantner's Deli, yeah. I used to... Um, the first time I ever heard of Tequila Mockingbird, or the first time that I was ever like knew met someone that actually like had met her or knew something about her, I used to go to Canner's Deli a lot to do photos with the Rock and Roll Circus, that bar in the back, I forget what it's called, and they used to play at like midnight to 3 a.m. on Sunday nights, or sun Monday mornings, whatever. Yeah. And I used to hang out with this girl, Allison Shaleen, who used to perform with the group. Cool. Yeah, Willie Chambers plays on Sunday nights over there. Yeah, they have open mic nights. Yeah, to be able to perform. Yeah, it's a pretty fun place. I haven't been there for a while, though. Like, yeah. I, I kind of dropped out a little bit because a couple years ago, I got unemployed for a year. So <laughs> We've I was, all like, been I, there. I was there. like broke for a year. Like, Struggling kinda, Americans. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> And now I have two jobs and I'm still struggling. <laughs> yeah, but at least we're getting famous, right? Yes, exactly. <laughs> right on.